Well, hello, 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 and welcome to Omi's Garage. Today, we're gonna to be trying to remove a stripped lug nut. All right, welcome to my channel. Uh, you know, if you follow my channel, you know that uh, I've picked up this uh, 2007 Mini Cooper. It's an R56 hatchback, um, non-turbo. And um, I'm pretty much just doing everything on it, you know, and getting it back to uh, pretty good shape. So I have my brakes that came in, and when I was trying to remove the lug nuts, one of them was stripped, you know, and the other ones were put on extremely tight. So now I got to figure out how to get that stripped lug nut out. So I'm going to be trying out a stripped lug nut socket. All right, so this is the set that I got. I got this off of Amazon. Well, 17 millimeters is what the lug nuts are uh, on a 2007 Mini Cooper. And I'm sure most Mini Coopers and a lot of BMWs share, uh, share the same thing. Uh, so this is what we'll end up using. That will go over that. And hopefully, you know, this should work out. All right, so the lug nut that's stripped, this one that you can see is kind of a, uh, eaten up it's chewed up a little bit because i've been trying everything i just wanted to show you uh i picked up one of these um these are also you know supposed to be for strip lug nuts um so they have these little teeth that kind of come in and out i'm sure if you can see that but there's these teeth that come in and out the problem with this is that once you put it in this needs to go forward this sleeve needs to move forward and it can't move forward to really get a good grip on it because of that. So that's why I'm going with uh, this different, you know, that's what that looks like. And this is supposed to really bite. It's got, it's got some uh, sharpness to it. And these are on really tight, so I'm curious to see if this is gonna work. All right, so what I'm gonna do in order to, because I know these, this, this lug nut's on there really tight. All right, so I know these bolts are on there super tight because they were over torqued because my other three that came off took a lot of force. So I'm gonna be using this as an extension for the breaker bar because otherwise I don't think it'll come off. And this is from my floor jack. Yep, I think it's working. And it came out. All right, so there's your tool. Now this thing is gonna be on there really tight. So what they, I think they include is this little bar, I'm guessing, uh, for that, so that you can actually uh, knock it out. All right, so here's what I'm gonna try, is I'm gonna get, grab that with some, uh, with some pliers. And then using this aluminum handle that I used before, I'm going to put that on there and I'm going to use that metal rod through there. And we're going to get the persuader. That's my persuader. So we're going to try this out and see how it works. And it's out. I can reuse that again. And there's the culprit. It was pretty, pretty stripped. That goes in the trash. All right, so that's gonna be it uh, for this set. And this has a 17 all the way to a, what is this? A 22. And I got a new bolt, so I prepared for that. Make sure before you take those off that you got the one that's going to replace it. So I'm definitely going to have to give this set 
a thumbs up. Um, it worked just like it, you know, just like it was advertised. So it says for removing worn or damaged nuts and it did exactly what it's supposed to. All right, so that's one problem that was solved. Um, I'm definitely gonna, you know, gonna have to recommend uh, that particular brand is called Shankly. It's off of Amazon. I'll put a link in the description and I'll also put it in my Amazon store. It's uh, amazon.com forward slash shop forward slash Omar's Garage. Um, anything that you see in my videos, I usually post on my, uh, my Amazon store. So that's something that I can highly recommend. It worked right away as you saw in the video. You just needed you know, a pretty big uh, breaker bar and um, that's it. So if you haven't done so already, go ahead and subscribe, like. If, you, if, if the video helped you out, go ahead and you know, give me a thumbs up, uh, leave a comment and follow me on Instagram. I'm also gonna be doing more daily uh, uploads um, on Instagram. So uh, regarding this project and everything else. So thanks for watching. You all take care and stay safe.